Would you like to know all the secrets of the Mediterranean diet? In Wellness Whispers, we explore its origins and benefits. We describe the style. We guide you on the food and all you've ever wanted to know about the Mediterranean diet. Sail with us around the Mediterranean coast to discover some wonderful recipes. Stay tuned to leave this new journey with us on UIC Radio on Thursday morning. Good morning. In our last episodes of Wellness Whispers, we have seen the basics of the Mediterranean diet, took a step on olive oil, and discussed with a French specialist, Dr. de Langeril. Today, we are uncovering the magic of polyphenols that are one of pillars of the benefits of the Mediterranean diet. And do you know that one of good source of polyphenol is wine? Polyphenols are antioxidants. What does it mean? According to Wikipedia, antioxidants are compounds that inhibit oxidation, a chemical reaction that can produce free radicals and chain reactions that may damage the cells of organisms. So, to make the long story short, polyphenols help our cells to stay healthy. They work on all our body cells, skin cells, red blood, neurons, fat cells, etc. Polyphenols may help prevent blood clots, reduce blood sugar levels, and lower heart disease risk. They may also promote brain function, improve digestion, and offer some protection against cancer. According to U.S. National Library of Medicine and National Institute of Health, more than 8,000 types of polyphenols have been identified. They can be further categorized into four main groups. The the first group is flavonoids. These account for around 60% of all polyphenols. Flavonoids are found in foods like apples, onions, dark chocolate, and red cabbage. The second group is phenolic acids. This group accounts for 30% of all polyphenols. Phenolic acids are mostly found in fruits, vegetables, whole grains, and seeds. The third category is polyphenolic amides like we found them in chili peppers and oats. All other polyphenols are in the fourth category, and we can find the resveratrol in red wine, elagic acid in berries, curcumin in turmeric, and lignans in flax seeds, sesame seeds, and whole grains. After this short break, we will discuss about wine. Feeding South Florida is the largest food bank serving Palm Beach, Broward, Miami-Dade, and Monroe counties. Feeding South Florida's mission is to end hunger in South Florida by providing immediate access to nutritious food, leading hunger and poverty advocacy efforts, and transforming lives through innovative programming and education. Last year, Feeding South Florida distributed over 145,000 million meals to over 1 million people. For every dollar donated to them, they can provide 9 meals. Every donation can change a life. So donate today on feedingsouthflorida.org. They count on you. So, What about wine? Are you used to drink a glass of red wine every night? Don't be ashamed, it is full of antioxidants. The high number of polyphenol in red wine contributes to that antioxidant count. Red wine has a total of 101 milligram polyphenols per 100 milliliter. Rosé and white wine 
while not as beneficial, still have a decent chunk of polyphenols with 100 milliliter of each having about 10 milligram polyphenols. To conclude this episode of Wellness Whispers, we can say that polyphenols are powerful micronutrients that our body needs. They have numerous health benefits that may offer protection from the development of cancers, cardiovascular disease, osteoporosis, and diabetes. And if you are curious and want to go further, I recommend you to consult the Phenol Explorer. It is a first comprehensive web-based database on polyphenol contents in foods. The web interface allows making various queries on the aggregated data to identify foods containing a given polyphenols or polyphenols present in a given food. Enjoy your day! Next week, we will continue our journey around the Mediterranean Sea and will reveal to you some new treasures. Until then, don't forget, with the Mediterranean diet, you can have your cake and manage your weight. Thanks for listening. This was Wellness Whispers by Valérie Seguin on UIC Radio.